the Chinese army released a video showing a few different types of anti-aircraft missiles in live firing exercise. The targets are remote-controlled drones, some carried infrared countermeasures. It demonstrates the Chinese army are utilizing all its weapons to work as an integrated system. The HQ-16 medium-range anti-aircraft system participated in the exercise. This missile system can partner with the HQ-9 long-range missiles, as well as HQ-7 and HQ-17 short-range missiles. The HQ-16 has a phased array multifunction radar to search and track multiple targets and control up to four missiles to engage. It adopts vertical launch design, can fire at any target within a 360-degree arc, capable of attacking low-flying objects. The HQ-16 is one of the latest missile systems in China, highly effective against combat aircraft, drones, cruise missiles and shorter medium-range ballistic missiles. In the video, the HQ-16 unit works with short-range missile units, as well as manned portable air defense systems. The HQ-16 system is carried by a 6x6 high-mobility truck, providing some off-road capabilities and superior on-road performance. This medium-range system can detect and shoot down flying objects as low as 10 meters above ground, ideal for defeating cruise missile or attack helicopter. The land-based HQ-16 missile system has been exported to Pakistan. The HQ-16 naval variant was developed for the Chinese Navy and is the primary air defense system of the Type 054-class frigate, also exported to Thailand and Pakistan. In the video, the Chinese army soldiers are firing the QW-2 man portable missiles. This missile is a Chinese infrared-guided surface-to-air missile. The missile has all-aspect IR homing, fire-and-forget design, and reported to have some Russian technology. The QW-2 is considered by analysts to have similar technology level as the American FIM-92E Stinger missile system. This video also shows the HQ-7 and the HQ-17 short-range missile systems working together to provide multiple layers of defense. The HQ-7 is a Chinese licensed production variant of the French Crotail missile system. And the HQ-17 is based on the Russian Tor missile system. It is clear that the Chinese army is fully aware of firepower of its potential opponents, including combat aircrafts from Indian military force, Taiwanese force, even the American Air Force and Army. There will be major advantage if the Chinese army can combine all its surface-to-air missile systems to work as an integrated firepower network that would create a fearsome defense-killing machine. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please subscribe, share and comment. It will really help us developing this channel and bring you more videos about Chinese military news. Thank you.